Did you know that there are 8.7 million species alive on Earth today? Pretty huge, right? What's even crazier is that we've only identified 1.3 million of them, which means there are millions of animals out there that we don't know much about. If anything, I love finding out about new weird and wonderful creatures, so today we're talking about 10 rare animals you never knew existed. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to The Supreme, and click the notification bell for more lit content. Let's get rolling. <laughs> Bryozoa. Okay, so at first I thought this was some kind of alien or a glowing mythical dragon egg, but it turns out that this strange mass is a bryozoa, an aquatic invertebrate that attaches itself to rock. Some bryozoans look like a mass of furry jelly, while others look like underwater moss. In the picture I found while researching for this video, the mass looks like one creature, but actually that is a whole clump of bryozoans. Individually they're small, but in colony clumps they can stretch to around 4 feet in length. These creatures have blobbed around the bottom of ponds and lakes for over 480 million years. So what is the purpose of the bryozoa? It seems that they are great at filtering nutrients from water. So, cool. Fingertip Chameleon I think this little guy might win the internet today. Meet the Brochesia Micra, also known as the Fingertip Chameleon. The teeny tiny reptile can only be found in one area of Madagascar and is so small that it can sit comfortably on the tip of a matchstick. So here's Camo. Um a veiled chameleon. Um. The maximum length of this tiny chameleon is just 1.1 inch, although males generally reach around 0.63 inches. Because of the remote area of the world that they live in, the little creatures were only discovered after 2003. They're easy to miss too. They're so small and they can usually be found hiding in fallen leaves or sleeping on tree branches. As these animals are so rare, there is concern that illegal logging will disrupt their habitat and threaten their overall existence. Hammerhead Bat You probably will have never seen a bat like this before. It's so weird looking that myth-busting website Snopes even ran a feature on it concluding that it is real. Also known as the big-lipped bat, this bat is the biggest found in Africa. They have a wingspan of 3 feet. Some people even refer to it as a mega bat, which sounds like a cool band name to me. The male of the species are the curious lookers and their enlarged features allow them to make a strange honking sound. Seriously, these bats honk like a goose. Despite their unusual and kinda comic appearance, these bats are known carriers of Ebola which makes them dangerous. <laughs> Giraffe-necked antelope Geronex look like regular antelope but with elongated necks and the strange love of standing on two legs. In the wild, there are about 95,000 of them and they're only found in the Horn of Africa. There are a few thousand in captivity in various zoos across the world. These animals are gentle herbivores and the reason they can stand on two legs is because they feed at higher reaches than other similar animals. By using their front legs to help them out, here right now they're backup quarterbacks. They're able to reach leaves six to eight feet off the ground. One of the more mind-blowing things that I learned about the Jaranuk was that they don't need to drink water at all. They get all the moisture they need from plants. I guess this is why they live in Africa. Personally, I need a bottle of water on me at all times. Black Spotted Couscous Okay, these little creatures are really cute. Have you ever heard of a couscous? I hadn't until today. They are related to possums and kind of look like a little slow loris, but they are unrelated. Couscous live in northern Australia and New Guinea, and the rarest of the gang are black spotted couscous. I'm just really enjoying saying the word couscous. These rare animals are around the size of a house cat and have a distinct rat-like tail. Red-lipped batfish Okay, who dropped lipstick in the ocean? And who is this fish trying to impress with those red smackers? 
I thought this fish was totally photoshopped until I saw a video of one swimming with a pout. This unusual fish can only be found in the cool waters of the Galapagos Islands and their lips aren't the only weird thing about them. They also have strange frog-like legs that they use for walking around on the seafloor. If you're diving between 30 to 60 feet down in the Pacific waters around the Galapagos, then you have a chance of glimpsing this fish, although they can also be found swimming much, much deeper. So, why the red lips? Well, hilariously, scientists do think that they have evolved that way to help them lure in mates, meaning their red lipstick makes them more attractive. Raccoon Dog I can't believe I didn't know that raccoon dogs existed until today. So despite their name, they're actually more fox than raccoon, they just have similar markings. Raccoon dogs are native to East Asia and have a long history as part of Japanese folklore. In the 1920s, the Soviet Union introduced raccoon dogs to its districts and territories in order to use them for fur. Things got out of hand, and now they're an invasive species in East Europe. While raccoon dogs may look cute, they carry a high number of parasitic worms, fleas, and infected ticks. Because of their adorable looks, some people have tried to illegally own them as pets. You say, I like marshmallows. I'm a marshmallow but they're not easily domesticated and have been known to run wild. In 2019, a pair of dogs terrorized a village in Nottinghamshire, England. After they dug their way out of their enclosure, because they were recaptured by authorities, they were reported to have screamed and snarled at locals. Maybe not so cute after all. Pink Dolphin Pink dolphins? To me, that sounds kinda mythical, but actually, they do exist. Firstly, freshwater dolphins exist in the Amazon River, although they are a rare spot. They aren't entirely pink, but certainly have a pinkish tinge to them. These river dolphins, also known as boto, are at risk for water contamination and newly built dams. At the moment, it's thought that their population is only in the tens of thousands. Rarer still are albino dolphins. Regular saltwater dolphins have been known to be born albino, which for them means they are bright pink. A bright pink dolphin has been spotted swimming in waters off the coast of Louisiana on several occasions. Locals call the dolphin Pinky. In 2014, it was reported that a pink dolphin had been born in captivity at Underwater World in Singapore. What do you guys think of pink dolphins? Can you believe that they're real? I feel like I'm learning so much today. Haikegani Crab Not only do Haikegani crabs look really strange, they're also attached to an enduring ancient Japanese legend. It's said that the crabs, whose shells bear more than a passing resemblance to a human face, contain the souls of samurai warriors who were slain at sea in 1185 AD. Why? Well, as the warriors' bodies sank to the seabed, it's said that the crabs ate their remains, therefore absorbing the souls of the soldiers. Now that's wild. These days, the crabs are said to roam the ocean floor looking for the lost treasures of the Japanese empire. Non-believers claim that the faces in the crab shells are nothing more than pareidolia, the phenomenon where people see human features in inanimate objects. What do you think? Are these rare crabs actually ancient imperial warriors? That was the 10 rare animals you never knew existed. You do now. Which one was your favorite animal? Did you know about any of these already? Are there any other weird creatures we should talk about in a future video? Let us know in the comments.